How'd I do? We're still alive, Lieutenant. I'd say you did good. Nomad! Thank God you made it! Take a look at this. One of the pilots brought it in. Oi, Nomad! Get a load of this ugly bastard! Yeah, okay. Psycho's Keep it steady. trophy. Hey, be careful! The Admiral's nuts bringing this thing on board. You got something to say, Collins? No, sir. I didn't think so. Dead now, ain't it? We saw what the, the same thing with our generators in the mine. These creatures drain energy from nearby power sources. You could have mentioned that before we brought it on board. Nomad, the Admiral wants to see you down in CDC. That video feed you sent back's causing a bit of a stir. Damn. Better get down there. You go on. I'll see you later. Come on, the Admiral's waiting. Glad you made it, Psycho. Where you been? Hurry up, mate! Petty Officer McCulligan, needed in the armory. Petty Officer McCulligan. The bridge is off limits, sir. You want CDC? It's downstairs. Nice. The Lexington's under attack. Close to the radius. Transferring all air traffic to us. All right, there's a hospital ship en route from Japan. It's gonna take time, so we have to make do. I want a trauma center in supply now. Yes, sir. <coughs> you going to CDC? Dr. Rosenthal, report to CDC. Dr. Rosenthal to the CDC. Dr. Ellis to the medical bay. Dr. Ellis to the medical bay. Ain't you the spec ops guy who went inside that thing? I'm gonna go find Prophet before he does something stupid. I'll catch you later. Strickland, if you can hear me, you've got to get everyone off this island. There's thousands of these things and they're waking up. It's an infestation. Nomad, you did a fine job out there, son. Thanks to your video feed, the Joint Chiefs have recommended a nuclear assault. As soon as I get final confirmation from the White House, we'll reduce these bastards to dust. Admiral, we shouldn't rush into any decisions here. We need time to explore other alternatives. You want to second-guess the President? The Joint Chiefs? I'm not sure you understand the gravity of the situation, Doctor. Just over a week ago, military intel sats detected abnormal heat signatures from that island. At first, we suspected the Koreans were testing nukes. CIA and NSA got word... It gets better. Four days ago, NASA picked up a high-frequency signal emanating from the center of the mountain. The beacon is directed at a star, somewhere in Galaxy M33. That's almost four million light-years away. It could be a distress signal. A call for help. You said the samples you found were millions of years old. That's true. But this technology is so advanced, it can't be terrestrial. What if they were stranded here, and now they're calling for help? Whatever they are, wherever they're from, we need to act quickly. I have planes armed with nuclear missiles on standby. With respect, sir, there's no guarantee a missile will even breach their defensive perimeter. You want guarantees by a toaster. I'm not gonna sit around and hypothesize while the safety of our planet is at stake. This is ridiculous. Those things have drained every power source they've come into contact with. The whole mountain is one giant power sink. Look at the schematic. This energy source runs through the entire structure of the mountain. Look at the shape of it. Compare it to the creature we brought on board. My guess is this thing's biological, a living entity that feeds on power. We can't predict what will happen if we use nuclear weapons against it. You care to predict what will happen if we don't? I think there's another way. I just need more time. There is no more time, Doctor. Sir, we just lost contact with the USS Lexington. I want all non-critical personnel out of here right now. I'll be in the armory. Come find me when you're through with this asshole. That means you too, Lieutenant. The 
saw your CEO heading down to the armory. He's probably waiting for you, sir. We're not equipped to deal with this man. You looking for the armory? Down the corridor, take a right. Rear hand cool wearing, report to the bridge. Rear hand cool wearing, please report to the bridge. Where it is you guys were inside that sphere. Man, those nano suits are something else. Yeah, I ran some preliminary tests. Kind of I've never seen anything like it. How he got it working is anyone's chance. Nomad, you made it. Hey, Nomad. You alright, mate? I've still got no idea how you rigged these weapons, boss. We don't understand it either. The firing mechanism is quite complex. It would take us weeks to reverse engineer it, yet you managed to modify them in the field. You even integrated the power source with your nano suit. Remarkable. Yes, I'm a natural. To put it mildly. Okay. Your suit should be fully operational with a few minor enhancements. I've diverted extra power to your hydro thrusters as requested. You're good to go, Major. Dr. Gillespie, I need to run some tests on Nomad's nano suit. I was told you'd be able to help. Certainly. Take a seat, Lieutenant. We're anxious to retrieve the environmental data from your suit's recording unit. Hey, boss. Where are you going? I'm gonna finish this. I reckon nuking the entire island is about as final as it gets. What Admiral Morrison does is not my concern. His nuke won't even scratch the surface. Prophet, wait! So, what can I do for you, Doctor? I've identified a signal pattern used by these creatures when they recharge. I think it makes them susceptible to an energy overload. Is there any way to transmit one of their signals via the nanosuit? Shouldn't be a problem. Let me see what I can do. What if I need to alter the frequency remotely? Fairly straightforward. You can send signals from any computer with a wireless connection. That should leave you room to experiment. What exactly are you guys doing to me? If my theory is correct, you'll be a walking weapon to fight these things. Then we'd better pray Morrison knows what he's doing. Dr. Rosenthal. Dr. Rosenthal to the bridge immediately. You shouldn't keep the Admiral waiting, Doctor. I can finish up here. Okay. Nomad, meet me up at the bridge as soon as you're ready. Pretty girl. Not many of those in my field. If I were ten years younger, I'd... Ah, there she is. Put her on the rack over there. Yep. Prototype tack cannon designed to be used in conjunction with the nano suit. We're still experimenting. It hasn't even been field tested. It fires a projectile tactical nuke. Works like a grenade launcher, but with a lot more bang for your buck. Whatever will they think of next? Can I try it out? <laughs> no. Well, I think we're done here, Lieutenant. I'll leave it to Dr. Rosenthal to fine-tune your transmitter. Thanks, Doc. No problem. You better get up to the bridge. The Admiral isn't known for his patience. 